After an inspirational return to WWE, the former Lock is risking everything to All keep right. his dreams of a WWE Championship match alive against Braun. Braun about to get this work. Just waiting for the uh, DQ, a no or not the DQ, for them to interfere. With no future in WWE, if he can't break Man, the break break what happened to Braun? You no, know, not getting man, called up during the draft or whatever. I wonder it's because of the dad. Title match against did a whole. Slade. With a chance what to was beat it? the deadline it was a transgender wrestler or something what a night. so i guess w, wwe got scared and didn't want to call him up Whoa, which has nothing to do with him outside. but he's taking some good yeah, hits. i'm with getting he's dangerously bad close to our desk that's it and well, trying to win here. it's kind of weird Ron, well it ain't kind of it is time. weird well that is a sign that definitely gets the point across he saw it coming oh my Grab a chair and use it inside the ring. All right. Apron up looking under there for something. Okay, he's re entering the ring. All right, Brian, let's get up. Why is the camera like this? Him with the chair now, aiming to injure for sure. Bro, what's up with the camera angle? There we go. Come on, Brian. I got a chair with your name on it. The ring now. Bop. Chair to the gut, softening him up. Mm. Is taking advantage oh, yeah, I forgot no DQ, no so. Disqualification match. Shawn Michaels is here to also take advantage of the lack of rules. Michaels is calling in the cavalry. This is going they all to be about to come on, running out. How can anyone stop and Brock and Roman better start coming out. Where are they? Ah, he laid them all out. To stop them. Have your faction take them out before they can get to you. Uh -huh. Moved by their leader, but can he capitalize and win this match? Randy Orton's here and he has no RKO. idea. RKO. Oh, low blow. blow from Orton. The Vipers lining up an RKO. And just a reminder, this is all perfect. Roman legal. Brock. Come on. Wait, what? Who the hell is that? Oh, that's international star chosen. It looks God. like the former lock had an ace up his sleeve. But Braun Breaker is recovered. And nope. he's got a kendo stick. But he reverses. Bop. Now he's battering Braun Breaker. Mm -hmm. Repeatedly with that kendo stick. Two steps ahead. I'm playing chess over Wait, here. Is he setting up Steiner recliner. His own move. And he locks it in with the kendo stick. Tap. Can Braun Breaker hold on? Tap. He can't. Braun tapped. It's over. And more importantly, he lives to fight another day. And will take on Slade for yeah. the WWE Championship. Shout out to Chosen. SummerSlam. Somehow he found a way I'm to play chess out. over here. Now he has an Two steps ahead. Before the championship or bust deadline expires. We'll see about that. But Shawn Michaels and company can't be pleased with how this turned out. They thought they were putting this all to an end. And instead, the fate of this man and the WWE Championship will be decided at SummerSlam. Big one out there. But bloody hell. You didn't think to tell me about Chosen? I thought about it. But then I also thought it'd be more fun to pull a Tavish on. Not the same. You don't know how to do it, Tavish. Either way, I couldn't risk it getting out. We needed any advantage we could get against them. Well, that's not what I wanted to talk about. I have a message. Still from watching SummerSlam. What does Shawn Michaels have to say for himself now? No, not Shawn. This came directly from the top. All this faction warfare has been big for ratings, so they want to see it continue. There will be a faction versus faction match to determine who gets to pick your oh stipulation God. at SummerSlam. Our side against Sean's. War games. We've already been in a battle. I guess now, it's time to go to war. There's war games. When well, we're chosen, won't. Well. Did you see I'm the number one trending topic? That's his problem. I only care about social media. Yeah, that's great. But more importantly, you helped me live to fight another day. So thank you. Where I've been watching you get beaten up so much. And you seem so desperate when you reached out asking for help that it was kind of a no-brainer to come save you. Yeah. Well, thanks again, I guess. Anyway, I don't know if you heard what Tavish said. I was standing five feet from him. Of course I had. Your two of us is kind of small, actually. Noted. Point is, I need one more team member for the War Games match. Oh, God, please not him. Interested in sticking around? No. Of course. 
I rather have Hector. What's going on social media? And to help you too. All right, let's do this. The following is a men's War Games match. The rules of the match War are games. as follows. Two teams will be contained in separate cages with one member of each team starting the match. At regular intervals, alternating members from each team will be released to enter the match. The team with the advantage will be the first to have a member released into the match. Once all competitors have entered, War Games officially begins. The match can be won by pinfall or submission. Exiting the cage will result in a forfeit. Now, let the War Games begin! I didn't think it was possible. Oh, me is late starting. Slam keeps getting hotter and hotter, adding explosive twists and turns every week. Get him down like before Japanese everyone else come in. Suiting up alongside the former what is only three phases three? three. The most anticipated war games matches in WWE history. All right, Fred, let's go to the other uh, side before other people come in. Is even allowed to compete in WWE? All's fair in love and war games, Saxton. Both foursomes are clearly willing to do whatever it takes with Damn. the WWE title matches stipulation hanging in the balance. Let the oh, what's coming Damn. here? Submission move being applied. Just. Remember, it's not going to work. Remember, the match hasn't even started, so I don't know what he's doing. Whoever has the advantage, so. Well, I already have the advantage since he damaged, so remember, for my team, should be next. Stomp him. He's channeling the crowd's energy. Oh, my God, what a crossbody. Yep. One more. Springboards help get from the ropes. Just defenseless the bars as the up momentum fastest. is against him. Oh, he's going to reevaluate his approach at this point. Slade us. We're about to jump him. Countdown's on and get ready because this will give one team mm -hmm. a greater mm -hmm. number of combatants. Got the nigga stun. Five seconds before Brock come in. Here comes the boom penalty kick. Being let loose to surely become the tide turner for their team. Where's Brock? He's turning the tables. Come on, bro. Yeah, he's Get able in to here. The bleeding, but will he also gain command? Are you putting weapons in the ring? Under the apron now, look at stack the odds even higher in their team's favor here. Bro, get in the ring. Wanting his skills now. We are looking at an unyielding attack from him. You can you can how's he bringing the table and all this other stuff in? I'm too busy looking at Brock now and get my ass on his sleeve now. Adding some extra spice to God the numbers it. advantage by coming in armed to Rock, the get your ass in the ring. Now, here we go. Fine. Through the ring door and adding a bit of left. I would say, where's the, the door? All right, Brock, let's get him double team. Mm -hmm. oh, beautiful teamwork. Oh, my goodness. Set the table up. Let's double team on again, Brock. As a matter of fact, let's throw him on the other side as well. Reversals, reversals, before Damian Priest come in. Mere seconds away from evening the odds in war games. Throw him on the other side. Just took a very unpleasant trip from ring to ring. From the outside, springboard misses the target. And here we go. Oh, Damian Priest, he's coming from this side. I'm stupid. I should have stayed. Oh, now nah, he got to walk all around though. Tackle. Nope. Miss timing with that springboard. Throw him through the table. And now they are part of the war, ready to fight for their platoon. And that was a well-executed attack. Uh -oh. Oh, no, this uh -oh. won't end well. Uh oh, got it. Like See? Sledgehammer can cause some serious damage. All right, come damage. on, Slade, get over here. He manages to escape it. Lands a knee. It stops on. He gets manhandled over into the opposite ring. How the hell did I miss? Slade out of harm's way. Left by the turnbuckles. And that was a successful bit of offense with that maneuver. Can't believe it, man. I missed the verse. Ouch. 
That's one way to get your opponent out of the corner. Close line. Well, that'll leave a mark. Reverse. Fought off with an elbow. Tribal Chief. Oh my God. Oh God. Oh man, into the neck breaker. Oh. And more hits up there can leave you dazed. We've got a numbers Let's get advantage in you another ring. We'll let Brock and Wesley go away. A big punch. Ouch. From the outside. Unleashed from the cage and beelining it to give their team an edge in the match. All right. Things could get ugly now. Man, get on the table. Head inside the cage. Slade, not ready for this. Oh, man. How in the world can he come back from that? Stay down. Pick the splinters out of your skin. Think about your longevity. Get on. Oh, what a suplex. The WWE Universe giving him an extra shot. Is Roman about to jump out? What is he doing? Oh, jump off the top of the cage? You can't climb, you can't out, climb out. In war games. There's no good reason to be up there. No, 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 no. Holy Damn. Hell. That's it. That's it. Unbelievable courage being shown. But why dive? You could have simply climbed out and won. I thought he just said you couldn't climb out. How do you recover from that? Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Here's the German. Are we keeping track? Oh hell no! You're not about to do that to my partner. Nah, bro. Nah, bro. Nah. Time is ticking away. Shortly, we'll have a fresh competitor to even the odds. It don't matter when your your teammate is badly beaten. How fresh you is? Nah, stop. Reinforcements about to arrive. Let's see what kind of impact they have. Match about to finally start. Mm -hmm. Oh, the sledgehammer Stunning. connects. That'll scramble your insides. And that was a hell of a maneuver there, guys. Looking for something under the apron before entering. Small one. He's not interested in just evening the odds. He wants the advantage. And that weapon bitch gives that. it to him. Oh, Brock has a special. Does Roman have one? He does not. He tosses him over and into the other ring. Man, why would he throw him back into this, this, this side? Really Too many people over here. To change the All right, of this nah, we about to go to the other other side so we have some space. Trap. One after the other. Slade put a stop to that. Textbook jump clothesline. Into the corner he goes. A perfectly placed target. Oh God! Come on, man. Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Wow! Stop. God damn it. Into the other ring. Damian Priest took my idea. Flying into the opposite ring. Oh, targeting the stomach. All the way up. Driven down with a sidewalk slam. Kick. All right. Let's hit him with a special and get out here. Buddy. Getting carried. Not sure what they're thinking. I can see some blood. Nine sec. Wait. Slade. That could end Slade right Wait, now. what? Is eight? Ah, I thought it was six. I'm stupid. I was about to go for the pin. I forgot about Chosen. The MVP. Damn it. Has to be to take charge, play the numbers game to your advantage now. Continues to focus on that region of the body. Surely is pinpointing that spot. Special. And he keeps his focus on an attack. To That's right. I might go to back up though. He's getting fired up now. Really feeding off this crowd. Thunderous clothesline. You know these eight minute tag matches be taking forever because they like to break the pin and stuff, so here comes the big dog. That'll stop you in your tracks. Close lines. Good lord. So effective. Hip attack. He gets out of the way. Man, hurry up and put him in the buster. Boom. Wow. And these attacks up in the neck area have what is it? What is it? Oh, move thief? I don't know. His, you know what? That would be good to beat him with his own move. Lesnar's got this closed up. Boom! Worse. Back and forth from these competitors. Dragon twist cutter. Hold on here. What good reason does he have to be climbing up the cage now? Oh! Moved at the right time. He's reached the top, but he's risking losing the whole match if he falls to the outside. And with his coming entrant, the teams will officially be evened up. Reverse 
reversal. Can he take advantage? Freed from the cage and now needs to make haste Stop. to even up the fight. Driven down with a sidewalk slam. I know Brock is not for the jump off the top. Stop. Crazy idea in mind from the looks of this. And we just saw some serious. I ring the bell. Coming in with the heavy hardware to even the odds. Counter upon counter. Great minds thinking alike. War Games has a big shot. Yeah. Fishing gun is about to be officially over. Hits the cutter. Will he be able to capitalize? He keeps his team in the match. Ah, oh, look at this. Headbutt. The sound of this crowd is deafening, and he's asking for more. Right hit him with his own specs. Come on, man. Niagara driver. Setting it up. All right, let's pin him and get out of here. For the win. And he closes it out. He put him away. He picks up the win. That was easy. No one even tried to break it up. Damn. Roman Reigns and chosen. This team of mercenaries has survived, and their War Games victory. Has now Let's go. The right to choose his SummerSlam stipulation. The former lock still faces long odds, but I guarantee he will take whatever advantage he can get. Man, this is a long arc. It all comes down to this: win the title at SummerSlam, and you're golden, set for life, probably. Lose? Uh, well, I might cut this up in the two videos. Gone forever. What happened to the Tavish who once told me there was an entire world of wrestling outside of WWE? I'm trying a different approach. Is it working? Not really. All right. Have you decided what type of match you're going to pick? Because I was thinking you should choose the safe match. I mean, it really don't matter As to me. In, like the safe choice? I'm not yeah, sure I don't want no interference. Be. So no, no disqualification has I to mean, be on. New match type I came up with called a safe match. You win by locking your opponent in the safe that you had in your WWE debut. Oh really? Everything comes full circle. It's called long-term storytelling, mate. <laughs> Do you love it? I'm not sure. Well, if you can't make up your mind about the match type, we at least need to know who's going to be in your corner. The faction started a pool on who you're going to pick. Go with chosen. The drinks are on me. Wait, what am I? Who am I? I'm picking who's gonna be in my corner. Probably gonna go with Roman. Roman or Brock? Probably go with Roman. I think he he had the highest overall at 99. Nothing against the rest of our crew, but I want him out there watching my back. Seriously? Not chosen one to pull, and he's never gonna shut up about it. But yeah, good choice. It's been a bit, but here we are, wrapping things up with SummerSlam approaching. Yep. You mean you're not going to follow me around the rest of my career? Is this the last yeah, match in a uh, story? To an end. I mean, Ooh. I know viewers think they want a super long story that goes on and on forever, but really, isn't something shorter with an actual ending better? It's like. You have this cool experience, and then you can go watch something from the women's division, right? Anyway, we're getting off track. SummerSlam's in L.A. of all places. <laughs> I know. It's a chance of redemption on so many levels. I'm back in the main event, but instead of a bunch of empty seats this time, we're the biggest thing in town, and it's sold out. It feels good. What about the match stipulation, though? I might be reading into this too much, but are you putting off making a decision because it means the match is officially here, and if you lose, you'll be faced with leaving WWE? Stop. Ain't nobody losing. Not at all. Despite my recent success, I'm going to need to do everything I can to win. So I've been keeping the match stipulation to myself as a strategic advantage. Makes sense. But what are you going to choose? You're going to have to announce it sooner than later. British Rules 2 out of 3, Extreme Rules, a normal match. Extreme Rules, they written. British, I don't want to need too much. I'm either going with normal or extreme. Do I need weapons? Probably not. I'm going to be in a normal match, but hey.
extreme rules that's fine as well if you want to use weapons we can do that if you need an answer it's going to be an extreme rules match I don't want any restrictions stopping me from doing whatever I need to do to beat Slade win the championship and hang on to my job solid choice she about to snitch it. well it's been fun and weird mostly fun though hope to see you around around here why he got the smirk on his face yeah you too cat so final thoughts heading into SummerSlam. Will you walk away champion and end your former friend's WWE career? Or will he somehow overcome the odds and beat the deadline? <laughs> Are those the type of questions you typically ask? If so, I'm glad I haven't wasted my time doing more of these. But if you need an answer, the lock is going to be looking for a job after SummerSlam. Is that and right? Let's get one thing straight. We were never friends. Hey, that's true. But I will take this opportunity. Never liked you. See, if he hadn't been such a failure and blown every opportunity that was handed to him, I might not be where I am today. So thanks for that. How embarrassing is it going to be when you lose? Despite the fact that you didn't get to even choose the match stipulation. I don't care what kind of match it is. It could be a blindfold match, a, a, a lumberjack Wish match, it was a lumberjack. a padlock on a pole match for all I care. Safe match. They all end the same. I win. Hey, we're on a tight schedule. So we need to make a call one way or another. <sighs> Understood. No idea why Shawn Michaels' super group is assembled here, but I guess we're about to find out. Slade, I know this might be a bit uncomfortable, but it's time to do what we discussed. Here we Stay go. We have some business to take care of. What's about to happen? What is going on here? I have a bad feeling about you this. You about to give up the title? I know we talked this over. But now that we're out here, it doesn't feel right. Slade, we've been over this already. Just do the right thing. Wait, about to relinqu win the match at relinquish the title? Just give me the Vacate chance. the title? It's been decided. We're going with Randy instead. So let's take care of this before it gets any more awkward. They about to jump I know him. I can get the job done. I really didn't want to do this in front of the entire world. Two factions about to be fighting. If you need me to explain why you can't get the job done, then I will. For start, the night the lock returned to WWE. You overruled me by facing it. And then I had to intervene to save your championship. Or how about the time you got beat down backstage? Which allowed this SummerSlam match to even happen in the first place. Or more recently, when our factions battled in war games, you lost. Allowing the opposition to choose the championship match stipulation. So, if you're not picking up on it, there's a common theme with you lately. Losing. Damn. But we're not about to lose the most important match in WWE history. But you know who's all about winning and is a proven commodity? The Viper Randy Orton. So Slade, do what you've done your entire career. Be a team player and fall in line. I was not expecting to see this tonight. Me neither. This is flat out wrong. They about to kick him out. They about to pull the Booger T on him. It's either that. How they kick Booger T out the NWO? We'll make the decision for you. Yep. Don't do it, Slade. Come on. You're better than this. They about to jump on like they did Booker T. You gonna hit him? No, no, no. He, he's going to do it. This is absolutely disgusting. What a farce. Could have put a CM Punk. And here and comes down. the referee to count the pinfall. What a joke. And Randy Orton is your new WWE champion. Unbelievable. I never thought we'd see a WWE championship 
change hands like this, but here we are. And what happens when Randy lose? I'm in shock too, but let's not. Oh, he about to turn his back on them. He gonna cost Slam Randy the match. It's just been drastically altered. The challenger had game plan to face Slade, but will now be up against a much different opponent in Randy Orton. I agree, Corey. Beating the deadline was going to be difficult, but it just got significantly harder, in my opinion.